Okay, so now I want to take a look at some word problems that actually involve logarithms. So that's right, it's time once again for solving real world problems, but this time using logs. Okay, so now the first one I want to tell you about is, oh my god, it's an earthquake, it's an earthquake, get on your tables, get on your tables. <sighs> okay, hope you're okay. Wow, I wonder, I wonder what kind of earthquake, that was a serious earthquake. It really was. And I wonder, in fact, what the intensity was. If we measure that on the Richter scale. Now I can make a phone call here and try. Beep, 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 beep. Well, okay, that's my own sound effect, but let's see. I'm going to find out what the intensity of that was, because that was something, I'll tell you. The crew, by the way, has left the building. Uh, yes, what was the uh, intensity of that uh, earthquake we just felt? Uh, no, we did have an earthquake. Well, we had one here in the studio. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, what was it? Okay, okay, okay. It was an intensity of, wow, 398,107,000. I not. Okay. All right, thank you very much. Thanks, bye. All right. I'm still a little shaken by that. But it turns out that actually, if you want to figure out on the Richter scale what an earthquake actually you know, showed up at, you can figure that out using logarithms because here's the formula for it. The Richter scale is actually a logarithmic scale. And it's just log of i, the intensity, divided by i naught. And i naught just is a sort of the, uh, the measure of a, of a zero level earthquake, it's called. It's sort of a standardizing thing. So in fact, when you actually measure the intensity of an earthquake, it's always in terms of i naught. OK, well, even though I'm shaken, let's see if we can actually now figure out what the Richter scale measure we would have for the earthquake we just had. Well, all I've got to do is sort of plug into this formula. So r equals the log, and that means log base 10, i over i naught. So the Richter scale for this one would be log of, well, on the top I'd have 3981070000 i naught divided by i naught. By the way, i sub 0 is sometimes referred to as i naught. Well, these cancel, and so I just see the log of 3981070000. So that actually is what this earthquake would have shown up on the Richter scale. Let's see if I can actually compute that for you. I don't know, that might be too big of a number. We'll give it a shot. 3981071238. 8.599 on the Richter scale. That is, now you understand why I was so scared. I computed that on the calculator, and I see that this earthquake registered an 8.599 on the Richter scale. So the Richter scale is a logarithmic scale that requires logs. Now you can actually figure out exactly how fast or how awful or how serious an earthquake was. Whew. Well, I'm going to collect myself, collect my thoughts. We'll come back, try some more world problems up next.